Welcome to Academic Game Tutorials. In this video we will discuss about economics from different perspectives of different economists. This video is a part of our course on engineering economics. We will cover all related topics one by one. Before starting, if you haven't subscribed to this channel yet, just click on subscribe and press the bell icon. Here, we come up with new videos on different subjects to make the academic studies easier for you. So, into the topic. Economics from different perspectives of different economists. Add the wealth definition. Before the emergence of the concepts of economics it was known as political economy. The philosopher Adam Smith defines the subject in his book An Inquiry into the Nature and Causes of the Wealth of Nations, in 1776. For his contribution, he is well known as the father of economics. According to him, economics is a branch of science that is concerned with an inquiry into the nature and causes of the wealth of nations. He basically examined why some countries are richer and some are poorer. What are the basic economic factors that, that can increase the wealth of an economy? He realized that the wealth of a nation is neither gold as thought by the mercantilists nor the agriculture as thought by the physiocrats. Be the welfare definition. Alfred Marshall provides a still widely cited definition in his textbook, Principles of Economics, written in 1890. Political economy, or economics, is a study of mankind in the ordinary business of life, it examines that part of individual and social action which is most closely connected with the attainment and with the use of the material requisites of well-being. Thus it is on the one side a study of wealth, and on the other, and more important side, a part of the study of man. See the scarcity definition. Lionel Robbins, in 1932, defines economics as a science which studies human behavior as a relationship between ends and scarce means which have alternative uses. D. The growth definition. Samuelson defines economics as the study of how societies use scarce resources to produce valuable commodities and distribute those among different people. E. The choice making or modern definition. According to Professor A. C. Das, economics is the study of choice making by individuals, institutions, societies, nations and world under conditions of scarcity and surplus towards maximizing benefits and satisfying their unlimited present and growing future needs. In short, the subject economics is defined as the study of choices by all in maximizing production and consumption benefits with the given resources of scarce and surplus for present and future needs. So, we have learnt about economics from different perspectives of different economists. Thank you.